Legacy Kernel Cola Preventing Sleep Mode I have a problem with Windows 7 not sleeping. Says a Legacy Kernel Cola driver prevents the sleep mode. This is not very helpful or informative. How do I get more details about that object? Edit. I found that. Is the best way of dealing with such misbehaving drivers and software. The option requests override is not very well documented. MSDN doesn't mention name is case sensitive. And to remove a request from overrides list you give the option with blank request parameter. Thanks for all the suggestions. Finally I narrowed down the problem simply by trial and error, disabling devices and rebooting. It was a TV card driver hung and not releasing the power request despite being no longer in use. Edit. Unfortunately, the problem with TV card is intermittently recurring. Googling shows it's also quite common. I found that disallowing the driver from making power requests with solves it. Legacy kernel caller is translated on different Windows language versions. On my Polish system it says starstsego typu abayekt y wiluyasi yadro. From the start menu, type in performance information and tools. Click the advanced tools and click generate a system health report. It should point out legacy driver issues. Edit. Also try, power CFG request. I had this issue and the legacy kernel caller kept coming back intermittently, even though it was verifiably on the list of things to be ignored. In case anyone still has problems like that, Here's a link to a batch file plus explanation of how to set up a task, both were a learning curve which I never want to repeat. This URL. The batch file basically performs the sleep management. A main loop runs for 300s, standard loop with 300 iterations and a ping command with count equals 2 to control the duration, reading the output of PowerKev requests each time. If it finds anything other than display, system, active lock screen, none, or, driver, legacy kernel caller on a line, then the main loop is restarted. If the end of the main loop is reached, the command rundle32.xpowprof.dll, set suspend state 0, 0,1,0 is executed. On Windows 10, it seems it is necessary to run PowerKev hibernate off to get a proper sleep state, so I include this in the code prior to the sleep command to make sure. In my case it was Spotify that misbehaved. People are going ballistic in their forums over this bug. Solution, quit Spotify before putting computer to sleep slash hibernate. I still question why on earth Windows allow a poorly programmed piece of software to override all power plan settings and create wake timers. Microsoft should take their share of the blame here. Edit, seems like issue is closed three days ago so I guess we should expect a fix soon.